Hi guys. Sorry, I completely forgot that I was doing a video on this horse and her blanket, but yes, I'm forgetful. If you're going to watch my videos, you'll probably come to notice that. Yeah. So, I'll just make him. This is Cody. He's really nice. I like him. And I'm going to make him a blanket. Oh gosh, I'm going to stretch my felt. So, um, yeah, this one's probably going to be kind of small. Because he's more of a pony. And I'll just do a quick little teddy teddy. Do, 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 do. Um, yeah. Oops, kind of ripped it there. Oh well, that's not so bad. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut a tiny U out of this felt to make his neck shape. It's either going to be a U or a part of a triangle, maybe. And it looks like that. And you're going to do the borders. I'm going to see if I can find some ribbon. I only had so much. Yay! I found more pink. He's manly. Real men wear pink. I guess. Real stallions wear pink. <laughs> yeah. So, I'm just gonna do a quick little hot glue job. Sorry, gonna need to get a little closer. Excuse me, I gotta sneeze. Sorry, my pitches. Uh, I have a weird high pitch sneeze. It's normal. I'm fine, Mom. She's overprotective of me. I'm sorry. Oh, crap. Crap cakes. It got stuck to the top of my nail. Oh. It's hot and sticky. Be very careful. Have adult supervision if you aren't an adult already because I know some Schleich collectors are probably adults already. Yeah. I'm just gonna do a quick hot glue job on here. Doop, doop, doop. And I'm gonna press it down with my scissors, the tip of them. I won't get burned that way, and the scissors aren't harmed, you can just pick the hot glue off later. Also, with this kind of um, ribbon, this translucent ribbon, um, the hot glue goes straight through it really easily. So, you're going to need to press down with something other than your fingers or nails because my nails aren't so sensitive. 
Is that even possible for nails to be sensitive? If you know the answer to that question, would you put it in the comment section? Um, so yeah, guys, um, I'm just gonna do the neck really quickly. I'm sorry, my camera's running out of room, so I'm gonna try to go as quick as I can. Um, yeah, so... I'm just gonna do three little hot glue dots. I'm gonna put this in the middle and press down. Nope, nope, nope. This keeps happening. I mean, what the heck? Why does it keep sticking to my nails? Eh. Carefully. Ooh. Oh, that's not heat. That's coldness. <laughs> that's kind of weird. Gonna do a tiny snip. Whoop. That makes it bend a lot easier. A lot, a lot, a lot easier. So, I'm gonna cut off the rest that I don't need, the excess. Oh my gosh, no! Um, I'm gonna need to re hot glue that, re glue it. Da -da -da -da. I keep randomly humming and stuff. Sorry, guys. So, uh, yeah, there's that. It looks, oh gosh, it's stuck to the plate. It looks okay so far. I'm just going to trim it a little bit. And I'm just going to do a quick neck measurement. And since this looks okay, I'm going to do it there. Do the tiny little glue dots on this side. Doop. Doop. Oh my gosh. Didn't get any out. <laughs> and I'm just going to press on here. And on here. Oh. Okay. And if there isn't enough room for your horse's neck to go in, which mine has that issue, you can just do a quick little snippy job. Right there. It will rip more easily, so you're going to have to be carefuler, or more careful with your blanket if you do the snip in the middle. Which I know this is not the best job that I've done, but um, you know, uh, my camera's running out of room and I'm almost to the limit, so I'm gonna have to cut it off here, guys. Bye!